Hi, it's Stuart Appleby here. We're actually not going to hit a shot. We're going to talk about how to decide what shot we're going to hit. Um, behind me, I've got a flag probably a good 12 to 14 metres away. And the green from the edge to the flag, probably six to eight. So you can see predominantly there's a lot of dead ground to cover. So what, as professionals, we tend to be followed to uh, lead towards when chipping is try and get the ball on the green as soon as the green starts. If you've got four metres of green to work with, use the four metres. If you've got 15, use 15. If it's a flop shot in two metres, obviously you're gonna to have to use nearly everything there. So when you come to these decisions where I've got eight to nine metres at least in front of me, um, I need to get that ball ultimately near as I can to that edge so it rolls out. These are the things, if you wanna putter from here, that's fine too. If you're comfortable putting it, running it along the ground, it just does make it harder to get your speed right. But when you can get that ball on the edge and track it to the hole, from varying lengths, again, two, four metres out to 10 metres. Try that, you'll get more consistency on the green than you will around the fringes.